What's going on guys? Welcome back to another Discord.js video. In this video, we're going to be coding a bot that sends a private message or a personal message to a member that uses a special command. This is something that a lot of Discord bots use, something like the help command or a special link or anything that you don't want to spam your Discord server with and you want the bot to kind of private message the author of the command uh, and yeah so this is a youtube channel if you're new here where i code different discord bots and i usually take suggestions from the comment section below so if you have a suggestion make sure to leave it down in the comments section also if you are new here make sure to check out the first two videos in this playlist the first video will kind of show you how to set everything up and the second video will show you how to do commands because there's a lot of ways you can do commands and we are doing a different method uh, so make sure to check that video out and yeah there'll be a link in the description for that also if you don't want to follow along and you just want the code i will have the code in the description in a paste bin just click on the paste bin copy the code if you don't want to follow along or if you're messing up that code will be in the description below all right let's go ahead and get started First things first is we actually have to change some things in the const discord. Let's go ahead and remove the discord right here, the name of our const. And what we want to do is open up some brackets and we want to pass in clients and we also want to pass in rich embed. And what this is going to do is allow us to use the rich embed so we can send an embed to that member who uses the command if you don't want to have an embed you don't have to do this but for this video we're going to send an embed to uh, that author of that message also right here down below the con spots equal new discord client delete the discord dots and just leave clients and the parentheses uh, and if you do get an error make sure you did this part because this is very vital uh, when you do something like this and did i type client correct i did type client correct all right let's move down into the help command all right so we're going to be sending an embed so we're going to create a const embed and it's going to be equal to new rich embed and we are going to set up the title first so the title we're just going to name it helper uh helper it's a command i i, I don't know so helper embed there we go and then we're going to set the color and i think for red we do zero x ff and then four zeros so that is red and actually let me go ahead and format this a little bit better so you guys can see there we go and then one more dot and we are going to set the description and if you don't know what i'm doing here there's also a, another video on this channel where i show you guys how to do embeds and this is going to be a very simple embed but you can get very very complicated uh, so there'll be a link in the description to that video as well so let's open this up and the description we're just going to send um make sure to use the help command to uh get access to the commands or something like that all right and then now this is the important the main part of this tutorial we're going to send this in a private message and it's very simple that's probably why this video is very short it's just message that author that send and we're going to send the embed one quick thing is this is actually the second time i have to record this there was a problem with my last recording so if we save this and open our terminal i actually got a new terminal but if you want to use the old terminal go to vs code terminal new terminal and you can do the commands here but i got a new terminal cmder and we're just going to run node space dot and the body is going to be online we come here into our personal discord youtube tutorial server here and we do the help command once again this is the second i think third time i record this tutorial uh but any, you know anyways we send a command we're going to get a private message by lionbot and it's going to send an embed so this is what happened last time i tried recording and this is the new embed we have here helper embed make sure to use the help command to get access to commands the color is red and we're sending that embed to that member in a private message you can pretty much send whatever you want so if you don't want to send embed and you just want to send something uh like a string or something you know simple so we can do something like uh this is coming from lionbot or something um and we kind of reset our bot here and we go back into discord and we go back into our channel and do the help command it's going to send this is coming from lion bots so pretty much anything that you send through here 
uh, inside these parentheses, it's going to be passed down as a private message. Uh, so we're going to leave it as an embed. And that is pretty much the end of the tutorial. This is something that you want to do to make your bots a little bit more professional. And a lot of people actually uh, decide to do this anytime you send a help command, uh, something like links or anything that you don't want to spam your Discord server with. So I actually have an example here. This is the PokeCord bots. This is a bot where you can actually catch Pokemon, train them and fight with your Pokemon on a Discord server. It's a very cool bot. And when I did the help command for this bot, it sent me a private message saying uh, this is what you have to do to kind of access the help. Uh, this is the link to the website to get started. These are the commands. Here's how shops and training works and pretty much you want to do this once again when you want to send private information or just general information but on a private message to someone and it's very professional so I suggest for you guys to do this. With that being said that will actually conclude this tutorial. The code will be in the description below in a paste bin. Make sure to click on it and copy it if you don't want to follow along with the video. And yeah I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did make sure to hit that like button, subscribe for more coding, more discord.js tutorials and I will see you guys later on my next video. Peace.